Hey everyone, welcome back to Waste of Paycheck Garage. I'm doing a little update video for those of you who didn't lose hope in me about, I don't know, six months ago. I think it was about seven months ago I made a video saying I was going to make a 500 horsepower 306. And I called the machine shop this week and I got one lined up. They told me to get it disassembled and bring it down whenever I can. So hopefully this block's going to be going down in the machine shop in the next week or two. And they can get started on it. They're going to magnaflux it, clean it up, put it in a hot tank, make sure the block's good. No cracks or anything. And then uh, we'll go from there. They're going to see if 30 over will get it. Um, DSS makes pistons for these now. So if 30 over will get it, I'll have to order some 30 over pistons. Going forged pistons, forged rods from Molnar and that cylinder head over there, which is from Promax, it's CNC ported, and it has like two inch valves in it, heavy valve springs, seven sixteenths rocker studs. It's just a beefy cylinder head. But I want to give you guys an update, let you guys know that this is still happening. Um, life just gets in the way, you know, got a lot of work to do, not a lot of time, and most of the time not a lot of money either, but it is finally going to happen. Um, I got enough set up to the side till I think finish this project. So I'm going to hopefully get this going and hopefully have this engine done and swapped in sometime. Hopefully this winter will be a winter project for sure. Um, and I may be even thinking about doing a custom header instead of the HD manifold, but we will, we'll see how early in the year, how, how long this project takes, but uh, we'll see. I just want to let you guys know that don't give up on me yet. So that's it for today's episode. I guess I don't really have any other updates other than that, but I do have a machine shop picked out. I talked to them. They told me to bring it on down to give me the go ahead. So it's finally happening. I finally got the ball rolling and um, I'm pretty excited to get it done. And I actually think I'm going to do something a little different with the paint scheme. I'm not just going to go with your typical Ford blue. I think you guys will like it. And uh, I'm just excited to get this project done. So I'm glad I finally got it rolling. So stay tuned. Definitely more to come with this one. So if you guys want to see more about this and you want to see this engine done, you want to see it put in the truck, hopefully making close to 500 horsepower somewhere in that ballpark and maybe possibly pushing close to 20 pounds of boost, then uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, I will keep you guys posted as much as I can along the way. I'm thinking about having the machine shop just do the short block assembly and I'll get it back and I'll just put the cylinder head on, do my paint, valve train, roller rocker, stuff like that. Um, we'll just see. It depends how much they charge. Um, it's just easier they do it. And uh, if you guys want to see that, please like and subscribe. And um, thanks for following along. Till next time, this has been Wasted Pet Truck Garage.